Hey, hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to the channels. In this video, I'll be uh, talking about how I upgraded the, uh, the memory. Uh, my computer is the Dell XPS uh, 8700. Uh, when I first bought it, it came with 12 gigabyte of RAMs. I just bought uh, 16 more total. Uh, and it, uh, each uh, stick, it's uh, eight gigabyte. And this is how uh, I installed it to, for the um, computer to recognize uh, uh, the memory. So there's our four slots, as you can see in here. And it's labeled as four, uh, four, one, four, four, uh, two, four, one, and three. So when I first installed it, I removed uh, the one and a four, and then I put the new ones in. That didn't work. The computer kept on uh, restarting. It wouldn't load anything. So I removed, uh, I removed the one and two. No, the, I removed the number three and four. Yep, the one and th the number one, and the, the number one and number three slots. And I installed the two new RAMs into one and three. And the system boot up right away. And it was pretty easy. And as you can see, right here, now it recognized my RAMs as 24 gigabyte instead of uh, uh, 12. So the one in the slot uh, one and three, um, there are two gigabyte each, and this one is made from China. Um, okay, so so if anybody's having issues or uh, installing their RAMs, hopefully this is gonna help you guys out. At the same time, while I was in here, I have the little M stator um, right there. Uh, there's a slot available for the motherboard, so I might as well install it. I, ha I have a 256 gigabyte laying around, so I installed it, and the motherboard uh, detects it right away. Pretty nice and easy. I couldn't find the screws, uh, the two small screws for it, so I took out, uh, I got it from my remote, uh, control remote, and I just, it just happened to, me to be the same size, and I just put it in there. There you go, guys. So now I have... I have uh, the, right here, a little bit of my computer. I didn't change much besides the two things that I just talked about. And this is the uh, SSD drive underneath here. It's a one terabyte uh, from uh, SanDisk. Got it about $130 or something. And here is my backup drive. This is the, the one that came with the computer, one terabyte, which I have the system, the OS installed already. I just did a clone, but uh, uh, I'm not installing it. Uh, I'm not connecting it. Uh, that's what it. I'm, that's what it is. And right here, this is another drive. is a three terabyte uh, C drive, a uh, Seagate. Okay. So the rest is stock. And uh, I think I've had this computer for about four or five years now, and it's been great. Uh, recently, I did something that I screwed up on the uh, operating system, but however, I got it back to working, and uh, everything's working right now. So if you guys have any questions regarding about the RAMs uh, or how to install the uh, M SATA drive, uh, leave it in the comment below. But uh, this is the RAM that is compatible with our system with the 8700 Dell. So it's PC3 uh, 12800, 1111, and then C1, okay? So with this system, I think I can max out at 32 gigabyte of RAMs, but uh, Maybe down the line I'll find, uh, but maybe in the, I'll probably remove uh, uh, the first two and then just put all eight, four or eight gigabyte to make it 32. But uh, other than that, thank you very much. Hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care.